Hey, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm gonna talk about top 5 best mini PC. Starting at number 5. GM Tech Nukebox K1. The Nukebox K1 leverages the excellent performance offered by the Ryzen 7 6800H processor and its integrated Radeon 680M GPU to outstanding effect. Using the same mobile processor as many high-specification laptops, making the K1 very close in performance to the B-Link SER6 Pro 7735HS that uses the Ryzen 7 7735HS mobile CPU. The entry-level SKU for the Nukebox K1 is a cheap barebone system where the purchaser must supply the DDR5 memory, NVMe, and an operating system. Alternatively, it can come pre-configured with up to 32GB of memory and 1TB of NVMe Gen 4 storage at a greater cost. However, beware that our review SKU came with a single 16GB memory module that underperformed without access to the bandwidth of dual-channel memory. With dual memory modules installed, the K1 is easily fast enough to blood the nose of the Intel Nuke 13 Pro and trounce any core i5 or Celeron-powered machines. Access for memory or storage changes is remarkably easy and doesn't even require the removal of screws. Coming at number 4. GM Tech Nukebox K1. The Nukebox K1 leverages the excellent performance offered by the Ryzen 7 6800H processor and its integrated Radeon 680M GPU to outstanding effect. Using the same mobile processor as many high-specification laptops, making the K1 very close in performance to the B-Link SER6 Pro 7735HS that uses the Ryzen 7 7735HS mobile CPU. The entry-level SKU for the Nukebox K1 is a cheap barebone system where the purchaser must supply the DDR5 memory, NVMe, and an operating system. Alternatively, it can come pre-configured with up to 32GB of memory and 1TB of NVMe Gen 4 storage at a greater cost. However, beware that our review SKU came with a single 16GB memory module that underperformed without access to the bandwidth of dual-channel memory. With dual memory modules installed, the K1 is easily fast enough to blood the nose of the Intel Nuke 13 Pro and trounce any core i5 or Celeron-powered machines. Access for memory or storage changes is remarkably easy and doesn't even require the removal of screws. At number 3. Geekam AS6. The AS6 is a different beast compared to the AS5. This Nuke system might look identical from the outside, but the Zen 3 Plus processor and DDR5 in this system can deliver a dramatically improved performance. Combining better bandwidth with DRR5 memory, a more power-efficient processor, a superior GPU and a PCIe 4.0 infrastructure, the AS6 has almost everything going for it. If it has weaknesses, these include a noisy cooling system, all-plastic construction, and the same Asus-designed interior layout where the motherboard is in two parts connected by a flexible ribbon cable. However, it has USB 4.0, and the two 2280M.2 NVMe slots are both Gen 4, allowing for plenty of performance storage to be added alongside a 2.5-inch SATA mechanism. Sadly, Agum supplies the machine with only a Gen 3 NVMe drive, but swapping it for something faster is a relatively inexpensive and straightforward exercise. With an asking price between $659 and $749, depending on the largely processor optional SKU, this isn't a cheap design, but it represents good value for a machine with 32GB of RAM and 1TB of storage as standard. For those wanting a high-performance nuke system that can take on most office challenges, the Geekum AS6 is yet another practical option. Number 2 of my list. B-Link U59 Mini PC. The B-Link U59 is a nuke-sized PC built around the Intel Celeron processor and 5105, 4C 4T, 4M cache, 2.0 GHz up to 2.9 GHz. It can come with 8GB or 16GB of RAM and up to a 512GB SATA SSD installed. Even with that modest silicon, the U59 performs well at basic tasks and has potential as a small office machine or for embedded applications. 
For 8GB customers, the RAM can be upgraded to 16GB, along with the M.2 SATA storage. There is also a bay inside for a 2.5-inch drive, for even more storage options. What seals this deal is the relatively low asking price of both the 8GB and 16GB models and the bloatware-free Windows 11 installation. Including dual HDMI outputs and dual gigabit LAN ports neatly positions the U59 for embedded use, ideal for providing product presentations or as a self-contained firewall. The B-Link U59 is easily one of the better nuke-sized machines we've seen, and it's cheap enough for even the tightest budgets. And number 1. Apple Mac Mini. Apple dropped an impressive update to its popular Mac Mini boasting a new M2 chip and a lower price than the M1, 2020, model. For businesses looking to maximize ROI, look no further than the Apple Mac Mini M2. Offering incredible performance and a lower price point, it's a machine that's hard to beat. With Apple claiming 1.9 times better CPU performance and 2.6 times faster GPU performance over the M1 model, we are keeping the Mac Mini at the top of our best computers for the business list, including the best mini PC of the year, especially when we compare it to more expensive machines or less powerful ones. Yes, we know that when you're looking for the best mini PC you might not think of a Mac, but with the ability to install Windows on the Mac Mini with ease, the hardware specs are hard to overlook. Check out this video description for latest price and more informations. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe and stay tuned.